Okay, how do you draw the Lewis structure for ACN? ACN means a hydrogen cyanide. So, how do you draw the Lewis structure for hydrogen cyanide acid, right? Okay, to draw, if you want to draw the Lewis, Lewis structure for ACN, at first you have to calculate the number of valency electrons present in this molecule. So, let us uh, find out the valency electron for ACN. Look, hydrogen is an element of group 1A, that is why it has one valence electron. Plus, carbon is an element of group 4A, that is why it has four valence electron. And nitrogen is an element of group 5A, right? 5A, so it has five valence electron. So, 5 plus 4 plus 1, that is totally you have 10 valence electron to draw the Lewis structure of ACN. This 10 valence electron has two tasks. The first task is to connect these three atoms plus this 10 valence electron will satisfy, sati will satisfy the duet for hydrogen, the octet for carbon and, and the octet for nitrogen. So, we have another way to find out the valence electron for ACN. Look, from the electronic configuration of hydrogen, the first cell is the valence shell and the number of electron present in valence shell is 1. So, hydrogen has 1 valence electron. For carbon element, the second shell is the valence shell or outermost shell and the number of electrons in second shell is 2 plus 2 that is 4 and for nitrogen it is 2 plus 3 5 so totally we have 10 valence electron right so let us do the first tax so at first we have to connect these three atom together right using this 10 valence electron so our compound is acin so look here the central atom is carbon because uh, its electronegativity is lower than nitrogen and hydrogen is always considered as an outer atom so carbon is the central atom so now we have to connect central atom with outer atom here we have two outer atoms one is hydrogen another is nitrogen so out of 10 valence electron to connect these three atom we have used four so look so now we have six valence electron left now we have to use this six valence electron to satisfy the octet and duet of outer atom first so this hydrogen has two valence electron so you can say that the duet for hydrogen is fulfilled but the octet of nitrogen is not fulfilled. To fulfill the octet, octet, nitrogen will take maximum 6 because here nitrogen has to, it needs 6, right? So now, look, nitrogen has this 8 valence electron, right? 8. But this carbon this carbon has four valence electron so we have no we have no extra valence electron so we have just 10 valence electron here right so we have to satisfy the octet of nitrogen and carbon at the same time so to do so what will what will it do look you have to move the lone pair as bond pair right so let us move move this so that you can understand these things clearly now this nitrogen has two four six eight this carbon has two four two four six right so you need to move more one pair of lone pair as bond pair so look now this nitrogen look has eight valence electron 
this carbon also has eight valence electron and this hydrogen has duet that is duet is completed then here octet will be completed right okay let us cut this duet octet then octet so ni this nitrogen has fulfilled its octet and this carbon has fulfilled its octet and this hydrogen has fulfilled its duet so you can say that this is the Lewis dot structure of hydrogen cyanide you can express this structure like this one two three that is in the in the hydrogen cyanide Lewis structure you will have one uh, lone pair and you will have one two three four bone pairs right so thank you for viewing this video be well